What's up friends, Chuck here, and welcome back to Monster Hunter World. Uh, we are ready to fight the Diabolos. So I went in and I killed the Rath in, uh, Rathalos, sorry, uh, without a gun lance this time, and all went well. So now watch it is time yourself. for, watch yourself, the Diabolos. So let's do it. Uh, PSN is currently down, so we're doing the old single player thing. Uh, I have no idea where to go for this, so let's just go 11, because why not? Uh, I was actually planning on hunting with um, Gradbor, aka Sean, and Mixedio today, uh, and trying to record, because I got some audio working. But PSN is down, so if it comes back up, uh, we'll try and do that. The only thing is, uh, I can't use my normal microphone, I have to use a headset microphone, so the audio is probably going to be eh. Like, the microphone audio. But at least it works, right? That's something. Um, I can get my proper microphone to work, but it's it's a pain in the ass, and uh, it makes everything really quiet for some reason. So if I just put the headset mic on, um, it just cuts down a lot of problems. So it's fine. Either way, we will go up against Diablos. Uh, we're using a bow because I like to bow a lot as I've mentioned a few times, uh, and in previous games, I'm pretty sure the Diablos is weak to ice. Um, and we have an ice bow, and our set gives us extra ice damage, so Aww. we're looking pretty good uh, as far as that goes. Let's take all of this. Um, we may as well take all this ammo as well, right? i got to get in the habit of doing it, because it's free. It's not supply. That'll just go into our um, stockpile back when we get home, so we may as well take it. Uh, but remember... I've got to remember at least uh, that there is 25 power shot power coatings in here, which is handy. So once we run out of power coatings, uh, we can come back and get 25 more. And if we find any nitro shrooms along the way, uh, we can make more as well, which is good. I uh, don't know where I'm going, so we probably want to go outside, right? Let's get this bone pile. Let's have a look at the map. I believe we probably want to go out here. Maybe? Perhaps? Let's go here. Let's see. Now, it is the first time fighting it, um, but we have seen it before, so I don't think there'll be the introduction um, cinematic or anything, like with the Rathian and Rathalos and all the rest of it. I think it's just, uh, you know, it'll just appear and we'll, we'll fight it. Which means... Oh, there's a Rathian here as well. Uh, which means that uh, it could be anywhere, right? Because if it's the first time you fight it and there's a um, screenshot... Uh, not a screenshot, a um, cinematic, then it's usually, you know, in a spawn location or whatever. But considering it's not, it... Okay, never mind. Never mind. I take it all back. Every single part of it, I've taken back. But we luckily went to the right place, so that was good. This thing is a beast, man. Not the Baroth. The Baroth is piss. The Diablos and its um, subspecies, like Black Diablos and stuff. Hurty, hurty much. So, I, I, I don't know why I chose the bow. I just figured I like the bow. We have an ice bow. Shit, this is a thunder bow. Ah, crap. Oh, well, we can go back to um, those fighting. Fuck you, Barrow. <laughs> this is the time to move. We need to go back and get our ice there. Because I don't goof. Uh oh. Can we even do that? We're now in a hole. Which is cool. Is 
if we can't fast travel out of here, I'm going to turn power coding off until we can fast travel. Very, very good. And the first thing we're going to do <laughs> is run away. <laughs> run away! Run away! Run away! Okay, I think we're good. We just need to wait for the uh, circle around our map to go from red to not red, <laughs> and then we can fast travel. But we may need to hide to do that, or just run away further. It sounds about it. It's like it's about to go. There we go. All right, let's just make sure I am actually wearing. Yes, I am. Okay, so we'll fast travel back to camp. Sorry about this. This was a bit of a clusterfuck. Uh, any camp doesn't really matter. There we go. That's the good thing about this. Well, a good thing, an awesome thing about this game is that um, in previous titles and stuff, if you left for a hunt with the wrong weapon or the wrong items or whatever, you bone, right? You have to forfeit the the quest or whatever. Here, you just like, oh shit, I made a mistake. Sorry. I'll go back and fix it. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Okay, we've got... Poison, sleep... Well, we'll just stick with power. Initially, at least. Okay, now that we know where it is, we can track it. Good doink. And we'll get there. Get back there a lot, a lot easier now. Do we have any... We have no slinger ammo, so let's just get some. Looks like it's just going to take us back to the exact same place we were anyway, so... Uh, we will probably put our... Let's put the Screamer pods on. So that if he goes underground, we can bring him back out. And let's finally start this fight. Alright, here we go. Not a happy chappy. Ow. That was with reduced damage. So, yes. Ow. This guy hits like a truck. Turn around. Fine, let's turn around. Ah, crap, I shot it. <laughs> Amazing. Whoa, there's a one shot. Damn. That is a hard hitting beast. It's a very hard hitting beast. Accidentally shot the, the flash bug, which was dumb. Um, I mean, our armor's not bad either. Like, it's the Lagania set, but like fully upgraded. So, as far as actual defense goes, we're at what? 186? I think we might be less because we're wearing, uh, we're using the bow. I think it, it takes it down. I can't remember actually. 
because in previous titles you have to you had gunner gear and armor and um blade master armor but in this they've just merged it and changed some things when depending on what weapon you're using so it might be less armor i'm not too sure but either way one shot is um <laughs> it's impressive to say the least Oops, not what I meant to do. horns already, so that's good. He's not happy. Whoa! Fuck me! Alright. Jesus! <laughs> I can't even freaking put my weapon away and roll in time. This guy's a beast! Well, we're gonna fail this for sure. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. It's fine. It's fine, it's not over yet. Let's get this ammo though. Oh, I didn't even pick it up. Okay, well we have one more shot at this. <laughs> um, I think we won't be using the... Uh, this move? at all unless it's like in a trap or something or like it's fallen over because it's just way too much of a wind up and uh considering how fast and hard how hard this thing hits it's you don't want to be stuck in one place right uh we could use the lance that would offer us protection um i could just use a switch axe because that's what i'm used to i actually thought the bow would be all right and it probably is, but I just suck. Either way, let's see how we go for round three. Let's actually put on a flash pod. Is he? Is he still here? No, he pissed off. Okay. Oh, holy crap! <laughs> holy crap! This would be a good victory if we could pull it off. It would be a fine victory. Stop gathering things so we can speed this up a bit. Apart from things I can just get along the way, like that. And it wasn't archer shooting, so we got more power coding as well, which is brilliant. Alright, he's up. He's up here. Extremely fortunate. <laughs> no! Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. 
This dude's way too quick, man. Our, our mantle as well. Uh, no, not, not that one. Put on the mantle. Put on the mantle. There we go. You never know if he's leaving or if he's just going underground to fucking couch. Oh man, this is some stress right here. At least we're getting um, more power coding, so this is nice. Uh, no, we're not gonna we're not gonna loot things unless it's mushrooms. We still have sleep coatings and and I think paralysis coatings as well. So did I go the wrong way? Apparently. No? No, I'm good. Okay, back into the den of death. No thanks. No, put your fucking bow away. Fuck me. <laughs> Turn around. Turn around. Yeah! Eat that shit, you big bastard. Didn't last very long, but better not. Now we need to get. Not Dung Pod, the other one. Where's the other one? Oh shit. Screamer Pod. I use it right. Oh god! I'm not equipped! <laughs> Shit! Equip that! Okay, we're good. Bitch. Okay, we can probably use one of these now. Oh god, maybe not. Oh no, we got away with it. Okay, back out. You coming? Or are you leaving? Wait. Right in the face. We've got this fight under wraps now, which just we just had a really shit start. Uh, I don't know if we can poison this dude. But we're certainly gonna try. I really tried to flash the fight in, but it didn't work. Where are 
you going? You leaving? I don't think you're leaving. Poison? Ouch! Let's put it to sleep. Oh! Shit! <laughs> Shit! I was waiting till he was running to towards me and then I was gonna do the flash bug thing. But I had my weapon out so instead of activating it I just shot. Which is super frustrating. Because I, th I think we had that in the end. Alright. Well. Lesson learned. Round two. It's good that the two uh, kind of boss enemies, boss monsters. Uh, I'm guessing these are the two uh, boss monsters of low rank. And then we'll go into high rank. That's my guess. Uh, but it's good that they're, they're giving you some trouble. You don't want the game to be too easy. But man, we sucked the first two deaths. Holy crap. Sucked the big one. So we'll give it another go. We'll go um, the bow again. <clears throat> Next up, Diablos. Diablos. Okay, take two. Uh, yeah, that was, that was pretty good, actually. As far as where to start from. We'll go have some food. Maybe we'll just get, we'll get, like, defensive food, right? Makes that a little bit tankier. Attack up, defense up medium, it's pretty good. Defense up medium, also good. Let's go with this. Man, stupid flash bug. I had the perfect, that's why I was standing right next to it. I'm like, all right, as soon as he comes, I'm going to flash bug him. He's going to go, ah! and then um, we've got this, but apparently not. I did forget to take my bomb thing. So I'm going to quickly grab Aww. them and we'll grab the ammo as well. So we want uh, da, 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 some of you. And we'll take dung pods just in case like a Rathian or something shows up. Alright. Um, we want to go with power. And we probably want... We'll start with Vitality Mantle. And what was it? It was up here. Is it this way? Am I going the wrong way already? I think I am. <laughs> I've already, already gotten confused. This looks more better. Okay, there's a Baroth just here. Somewhere. 
I'm going to assume he's in the same spot. He could not be, though. Oh, shit. <laughs> Never mind. We did it. We found him. Maybe we're going to start off by poisoning him. That might not be a bad, a bad call, actually. Oh, shit. We just wasted some. Man, the difference between pressing circle when you have a weapon out and when you don't have a weapon out is huge. <laughs> Get all this um research on him while he's running away too. Alright, here we go. Poisoned yet? He certainly looks like it. He's just, he's just noping out of there. That's fine. Thus is fine. Let's get that slinger pod wherever it was. I think it was over here. There it is. Slinger torch, I should say. Get some more mushrooms. Already this is going better. Uh, probably poison him up again. And we'll chuck on our Vitality Mantle when we get there. Sweet, some more power shot. Power coating. It's only two, but two's better than nothing. <laughs> Alright. Vitality Mantle on. Then we'll get Screamer Pods. Actually, we'll get... Flash pods. Where the shit did he go? What are you doing down there? Bad idea. <laughs> Can we mount him with a bow? Because that would be fantastic. Not quite. No, I didn't mean to do that. That's fine. Where is he? Where is he? There he is. Alright, get mounted by a bow. Yeah! <laughs> Eat it. Come on, dude. Fall over. Good camera angle. Yes! I did it. Eat that shit. No. 
Get your fucking weapon out. What are you doing? Oh, okay. So I completely botched that because I accidentally had the wrong coating on. Well, not the wrong coating, but. Poison? I can't quite tell. Vitality Mantle's doing its job. That's what I meant to do. Remove that. Okay, let's go with our coding. Knock him out, knock him out, knock him out, knock him out. Nope. Yeah. Fairly pissed off. Fuck. Oh, he was just running for it. <laughs> I thought I thought my couch was about to get all kinds of messed up. Woo! Alright. More power coding. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give Kessidons, get out of the way. Give me some of that potion. Or that herb, at least. Fuck you, dude. I was a bit charged. Got out of that relatively quickly. In the head! I don't even have power coding equipment. God damn it. Bullshit. Should not have done it while it was running at me.
<clears throat> Doing so much better. Wait. Okay, he did go downstairs. The little X showed up for a bit, but uh, I think it meant underneath us. Oh fuck, I thought he was gonna scream. Apparently not! Jesus! Dude! Right. Knocked himself out, which is nice. Tired boy! Capturable. And he's asleep. <laughs> Perfect timing. Holy shit. Alright, we did it. We finally did it. Not there. Slight oops. Slight, slight oops. Um, hey, buddy. Wake up. Come here. Come here. Yeah. Eat. That shit. Says he wants to talk to the we did it! Of the ecosystem. <laughs> Took us a while. Took us two attempts, but we did it. Nice. Very nice. Uh, yeah, as you can see, he hits hard. But he's a cool monster. I like it a lot. We broke the fuck out of his face. I don't know if we did much more than that, to be honest. Um, we shot his tail a bit, but didn't seem to do much. But we'll find out. Right now. That screenshot is marvelously bad, but we'll take it. I guess that's the thing when you capture things, like the screenshot's like right up close. Which is a bit disappointing. Um, okay, shell, bone, shell, dash extract, nice. Bridge. Love it. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. Accidental. <laughs> Accidental. Okay, what do we get? Horns? For breaking his horns. Breaking his back. 
capturing him. Yeah, so we didn't get the tail. That's fine. We didn't faint that time, so we went from fainting three times to not fainting at all. Which is really good. So, now that we have killed the Rathalos and the Diablos, we will have to go back to the first Wyvarian and have a chat. However, that will have to be next episode as uh, we're already at 42 minutes pretty much. And uh, yeah, I didn't expect to be able to have to do that twice, but it's fine. These things happen. So if there's any um, chats to do in town, we might do that quickly. Or oh, this might even be a cutscene talking to the first wife you're in. Yep. Uh, you, you have ascended to the apex and proved yourself. Now you may know the secret of the dragon that carries the mountain of fire on its back. The dragon hovers on the brink of death, but the light of life is calling to it, drawing it away from its proper grave. It has wandered into the Everstream and lost its way. Okay. Now it stands poised to perish there. Brimming with fiery life bringing energy. The Everstream connects every corner of this land like the veins of a beating heart. I wonder if this is the place in the Rotten Vale with the big X on it that we couldn't get through. Um, we'll find out. Should the dragon succumb to death there, its glut, glute of energy will hurtle through those veins, setting them afire and uh, seeing the land to ash and scorched. Not the best. Uh, that is the dragon's secret. That shall be this land's fate. Nature's cause cannot be swayed. All right. Everyone, please quiet down. Let's review our current situation. Thanks to the Fifth Fleet's diligent efforts, we've learned a number of things. One, that Zora Magdros is heading for the Everstream. Two, that upon its death, it'll release the bioenergy it has stored. And three, that the Everstream is connected to every corner of the New World. So, if Zora dies inside the Everstream, its bioenergy will blast us all to hell. Not the best. Commander, the Commission should make evacuation its first priority. I'll tell my sister to prepare her airship. There's no time. We don't have any choice but to take down Zora Magdaros. What? Throwing ourselves to oblivion is not what we're trying to do. Correct. And the whole reason we're here is to study the beast's role in the ecosystem. Not erase it from the ecosystem altogether. Um, I think I might have an alternative. What if we tried to lure it away from the Everstream somehow? Lure it away? With peanuts! Yes, sir. I did a little digging, and the Everstream borders the ocean, right? So if we can lure Zora Magdaros out onto the open water... We can mitigate the blast. Yeah. And the bioenergy released would start a whole new ecosystem in the ocean. Life would go on. Need I remind you, sir, that we're currently short on supplies from our attempt to capture it. And even if we had enough supplies, what kind of weapon could get that thing to change its course? Peanuts! Don't worry. I have a plan. A very big plan. <laughs> is that what I think it <laughs> is? That you just came up oh, with on the oh, top of your head. Now we're talking! Okay. Where the bait? Captain, you sure took your sweet time getting here. But we're happy you made it. Happy to be here. I brought everything you'll need. Ballista, cannon rounds, and a literal boatload of supplies. <laughs> Not to mention a little surprise. The guild supplied us with one hell of a ship. She's armed with the latest anti-elder dragon weapon. A Dragonator. Dragonator. Excellent. Just the weapon we need to drive Zora Magdaros out to sea. Hunters, it's time. Complete your preparations with speed and make your way to the Everstream. I'm gonna do it. I'll explain the details on site. We can do this. We must do this. 
May the Sapphire Star light our way. Now, get moving. Everyone just nods. It's time to see Zora Magdaros off. Oh, uh, man. I'm going to go quickly go through these um, exclamation marks, even though we're mad over you, because I don't want them just sitting there while I'm farming stuff. <laughs> uh, now that I think about it, wasn't the fifth that got us into the research started uh, to move forward. I was hoping you'd be the kick in the rear uh, and the commission. Sorry. I was hoping you'd be the kick in the rear, rear end. Makes more sense. The commission needed to make progress. But you're more than that. You're a damn force of nature is what you are. I'll just go ahead and pat myself on the back for being smart enough to bring Listen you Listen to me. Well, time is running short. You need to get to the Everstream. We'll run through what needs to be done on site. May the luck. Sapphire Star light your way. Yeah, yeah. Good. And then there's one more. This dude's probably got more stuff. Is my guess. Hey, buddy. It's now or never, new eh? products in stock. Well, I've got some new products. Have a look. All right. What do you got? What's new? Oh, okay, we could buy Power Charm and Armor Charm. That's awesome. Uh, so, for what, for like, newcomers and stuff, if we read these, an amulet that strengthens attacks. Just carrying this gives you demonic strength. Mm -hmm. uh, an amulet that increases defense. Just carrying this hardens your skin like stone. Um, if you buy these and you just have them in your bag as part of your items, like, like your potions and your null berries and your, you know, whatever, uh, you get just added defense and offense. But they are ridiculously expensive. Mm. So we will need to up our funds, which we're doing at the moment by um, growing and cultivating mite seeds, which I'll quickly show off. And this is a fairly good way of making money. Um, it's been a stock standard way of making money in all the Monster Hunter series. You unlock the farm and then you cultivate mite seeds. Uh, each mite seed is worth 140 zenny. Um, so if you can fertilize them, and you know make a shit ton uh each one of these harvest box that i'm getting of 20 lots of mite seeds selling for about 16 17 uh, 17 16 or 17k so we only need to do that a few times and uh we can already buy one of the charms and then we do that a few more times and buy another one of the charms and then just continue doing it for money in the bank and there's another way to get uh money but we aren't there just yet either way that is more than enough uh, sorry about the long one. It was an interesting one, though. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it. It's always thanks for watching. And I'll see you next time.